All right, so in this video, I'm going to talk about formula mass. So first, we're just going to find the formula mass of ammonium nitrate, NH4NO3. So to get the formula mass of this thing, all we have to do is just add up the atomic masses of every atom in here. So the way that we do that is we have nitrogen, we have hydrogen, and we have oxygen. And we look up the atomic masses for nitrogen, hydrogen, and oxygen. And then we also take into account how many atoms of each element there are. So for nitrogen, we have 14.01 AMU, and there are two of them. This is NH4, NO3, so there are two nitrogens. And then for the hydrogen, the atomic mass of hydrogen is 1.008 AMU, and there are four of them. And for the oxygen, the atomic mass of oxygen, and these atomic masses are all from the periodic table, by the way, so that's where I'm getting them from. The atomic mass of oxygen is 16.00 AMU, and there are three of them. So what we're going to do is just add these three quantities together, and that'll give us 80.05 AMU. So this is the formula mass for ammonium nitrate, 80.05 AMU. And another interesting thing about the formula mass, remember that the atomic mass of an element, which is in AMU, is numerically equal to its molar mass, which is in grams per mole. So therefore, now that we've calculated the formula mass of this compound, we can calculate its molar mass by just a simple conversion. So the molar mass of ammonium nitrate is equal to 80.05 grams per mole. So now we have an expression for the molar mass of this compound. So if I have one mole of ammonium nitrate, that mole of ammonium nitrate weighs 80.05 grams. And this is useful because this molar mass can be used in conversion factors. So suppose I weigh out 10.0 grams of ammonium nitrate. Well, I can set up a conversion factor, and I can figure out how many moles that is. So 10.0 grams of ammonium nitrate. I'm going to put grams of ammonium nitrate on the bottom. And I'm going to put the moles of ammonium nitrate on top. And we say that one mole of ammonium nitrate weighs 80.05 grams and making sure our units cancel, it looks like grams of ammonium nitrate cancels out with grams of ammonium nitrate. And we get 10.0 divided by 80.05, and that ends up being, with the proper number of significant figures and all that good stuff, 0 0.125 moles of ammonium nitrate. So that's just a quick little lesson on formula mass and molar mass. Formula mass, by the way, other terms like molecular mass and molecular weight, they pretty much mean the same thing as uh, formula mass, only molecular weight and molecular mass, they, they're talking about molecular compounds, so not ionic, but molecular. So, all right, there you go.